Bonjour à tous et bienvenue à Learn French with Likiza. Aujourd'hui, on va apprendre comment utiliser le verbe passé avec les verbes auxiliaires avoir et être au passé composé. Today, we are going to learn how to use the verb passé with the auxiliary verbs avoir and être in the past tense. Take a look at these two sentences. What do you think? If you think they are both correct, then you're right. Passé can be used with both être and avoir in the past tense or le passé composé. We use passé with être when we are talking about movement. And in this case, passé means to pass by. And that's why I can say something like Je suis passé devant son bureau plus tôt dans la journée. I passed by her office earlier in the day. One thing that is important to note is that if you see a preposition of place coming immediately after passé, it means that the auxiliary verb that you're going to use is être. Another important thing to note that is that when you're using passé with the auxiliary verb être, the past participle of passé must agree in gender and number with the subject. We use passé with avoir when we are talking about an action. For example, to pass something to someone, to take an exam, or to spend. And that is why I can say something like, J'ai passé Noël avec ma famille. I spent Christmas with my family. An important thing to note is that if you see a noun coming immediately after passé, it means that the auxiliary verb used is avoir. And also, the past participle of passé does not change form when you use the auxiliary verb avoir. Now, passé, to pass by in English, can either mean to pass by as in you did not enter or you entered and paid someone a visit. So how would you say it in French if you mean that you entered and paid someone a visit? In this case, we introduce the preposition of place, she. For example, Je suis passé chez elle cet après-midi pour prendre une tasse de café. I passed by her home this afternoon to have a cup of coffee. And I hope this lesson makes it easier for you to understand the usage of the verb passé with the auxiliary verbs avoir and être. If you enjoyed the lesson, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. You can also ring the notification bell and choose the all option so that you are always notified of new videos as soon as I upload them. I have put the two ways in which you can support me in the pinned comment. A bientôt!